Hi friends, in this video we are going to talk about how much health insurance uh, you require. We come across uh, different agents, advertisements and also we might have read the different uh, blogs in the internet about products and insurance companies pitching us that, we, that the ideal product to buy is 5 lakhs, 10 lakhs, 20 lakhs or even larger as per our uh, need. But in India, like what is the ideal sum insured that anyone should have? So I want to divide this in this into two parts. First one, uh, again based on the current economic condition of the person who is going to get insured and also the dependents. And second is about the future, like the rising cost of medical cost. So I would uh, fairly assume that uh, in India, like any the policy minimum policy that one person should have is like at least for uh, three to five lakhs, because any surgery, minor surgery or procedure that we have to undergo, usually uh, it comes around uh, one to two lakhs. Uh, where again, uh, any cap that comes around uh, like five five lakhs, uh, that's a good place to start. Uh, however. The insurance expense is as again rising, the insurance expense is rising and also the medical care expenses is also raising along with inflation. So every year uh, it raises by 5%, 10% or even 15% depending on the inflation. So now is our health insurance policy keeping us in line with the inflation and the rise in medical care expenses? which is the most important part. So for example, uh, if this year the procedure cost 2 lakhs, in 5-10 years the procedure might again cost us 5 lakhs or even 10 lakhs, uh, which is why our insurance policy that we have should be able to handle that level of expense that again we are uh, incurring as a part of the medical treatment. So it's important for us to ensure that uh, that we are having a certain level of sum insured, sum insured so that we don't have to shell out extra dollars towards medical treatment and also keep up with the uh, uh, inflation part and we can also there are additional uh, policies like top up insurance where if the sum insured is exhausted then the secondary top up will kick in which will cover for the any additional amount that exceeds the sum insured of the insurance policy. Uh, so I would recommend uh, you to again evaluate your economic condition and have at least a good sum insured for you as well as for your dependents so that uh, we can stay protected uh, during times of medical emergencies and uh, also again uh, have a policy that will be equally in line with the inflation uh, which will again cover the rise in medical care cost that happens year over year so that uh, uh, it doesn't put a dent uh, during times of uh, uh, medical emergencies. So I hope you find this video useful and uh, feel free to uh, share it with your friends so that they also get benefited out of this. And uh, please feel free to subscribe to this channel and uh, and press the bell icon so that next time when I launch a new video you tend to get the updates as soon as possible. Thank you so much.